Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. So today I'm heading to Poundland because I'm getting on the Mrs Hinch home craze uh, because somehow she has enticed me into cleaning. So I'm just on my lunch and I'm just walking to Poundland to see what I can find. <laughs> So Poundland is done and I think I'll just need to go to Pound Stretcher to have a look for the bits that I wanted that they didn't have. So yeah, back to work. So I'm doing a bit of a different video today. I'm going to do a cleaning haul which has been inspired by Mrs Hinge Home who is on Instagram. I'm sure some of you know what I'm talking about. She seems to have inspired lots and lots of people into cleaning and yeah, I think she's really, really brilliant. So she is Mrs Hinge Home underscore X underscore on Instagram and she's gone from having like four or five thousand followers to 136 followers in just over a month, which she must be doing something right. And I've been watching her highlights that are on her Instagram and she has highlights for cleaning different things throughout the home like washing machines, plug holes, skirting boards and the skirting boards one is pretty pretty good because it's fabric conditioner, hot water and the flora if you want to use the flora as well because it's basically something that won't damage your carpets and stuff so I need to try that one and she has different cleaning products and has different names for them so she has something that she kneels on called Neil and um, she has a Minka which if you watch her you'll understand what that is and I can't wait to get one once I get my hands on one I will be happy so some of the things she's inspired me to buy which don't get me wrong we keep our house clean and tidy and um, i won't say i clean all the time i keep like my bathroom and my kitchen clean and stuff but yeah she has inspired me to do more cleaning around the house so one of the first things that i saw on her channel which i knew i would use is this astonish oven and cookware cleaner um, I had a new kitchen, May 2017, um, and I got an electric oven, a leisure cook master, like range cooker, um, and on the top of it, obviously it's electric and it's glass, and it gets marked now and again, just from like, if you put the pan on and it overspills or whatever. Obviously, I clean it every time I cook on it, but there's been the odd little mark that I'd like to get off, so I thought I'd give that a go and it worked a treat. Rob did it and yeah I definitely recommend that because it worked and it looks really really good. Not that it didn't before but there was the odd mark that just needed to come off and that worked for that. So I picked that up at my local Poundland. Something else that I thought I'd be quite interested in is this SIF stainless cleaner. Um, so it's stainless steel ultra power and I have used this on my fridge. So yeah, it seems really, really good and I'm gonna use it on taps and stuff like that. So it thoroughly degreases and removes stubborn dirt like lime scale, watermarks and grease, but it also brings out a gleaming shine whilst curing for your surfaces. I also got this flash bathroom spray um, and it's recommended by Febreze. So I haven't used it yet, but I'm guessing it smells quite nice. And yeah, it's a fresh scent with long lasting shine. And Mrs. Hinge buys this in bulk, so it must be pretty good. I also got this Viacol spray. I couldn't get this at Poundland, so I ended up getting it at B&M Bargains. And it smells really nice, actually. I've used it on my kitchen sink. And yeah, just sprayed it down the plug holes and stuff. And it smelled for ages after. It smelled really, really nice. So I'd recommend that. I think it was two pounds roughly. And I also bought this Sith Cream with Micro Crystals. It removes 100% of toughest dirt and leaves it 100% shiny clean. 
So on the back, it says that it removes stubborn dirt like encrusted grease, um, burnt on food, lime scale. It requires less rinsing so that you can enjoy a perfect shiny clean right away. So yeah, I got that because when I've seen her cleaning the hob, um, she's also used this as well as that Astonish oven and cookware. So she put this on first and then used that. Um, and that is in the scent pink flower. There was a couple of others that didn't smell great. It smells quite nice that. And then she is crazy about wipes. So she recommended the flash wipes. They are again recommended by Febreze. And I got them in Mediterranean Lemon. You get 60 in there. And they are from Poundland. And yeah, they're just all-purpose wipes that you can use on surfaces or whatever you choose to use them on. I also got these Sif Power and Shine. Now, I would say I prefer these slightly more than those flash ones. And these are Citrus Fresh. And again, multi-purpose in the clean and disinfecting one wipe. So they were also from Pound Mom for a pound. She seems pretty crazy about cleaning sort of bathroom floors, kitchen floors with floor wipes. So in Poundland, I picked up these hard floor wipes and the big 30XXL wipes. And um, yeah, we've tried these on the floor. I've done it in the bathroom. Rob's tried it in the kitchen and they're really good for a pound and there's still loads left. Removes 99.9% .9 of bacteria, MRSA, Salmonella, E. coli. Tackles spills and stubborn marks. So, yeah, they're only a pound. So give them a go. I also picked up these microfiber cloths from Poundland. So you've got a multi-purpose one. One that's for kitchen and bathrooms and one for glass and windows. And they're by Blux. Not bad for a pound. Now, like I say, I would absolutely love one of these minkes. So, um, I'm gonna keep an eye out for those. And I just thought I'd show you some things that I have had in my cupboard generally for ages. I need to have a bit of a clear out of it. Multi-surface polish, everybody knows this, and I'm pretty sure everybody's got that. So yeah, that's just for multi-surface. As is this pledge one. I've got some carpet mousse to remove stains from the carpet. I've got Sif Power and Shine Antibacterial Multipurpose. Um, this Mr Muscle Bathroom Drain Gel. I've used that before and it is good, although quite pricey. Mr Sheen Express Mist, which again is like the polish. Um, but yeah, it's just like a little spray bottle. I've got this Actifoam Ocean Power Cleaning, which is multi-purpose three in one. And I think that is from Aldi. Leather cleaner for my sofa. This is really good. We usually use the flash one, but um, we've got this one in the cupboard. And again, that's from Aldi. Power cleaning, and we use that like in the mop bucket for mopping the kitchen out and the wooden flooring in the hallway. Um, so that's approved by the Good Housing Institute as well. Glade. Shake and vac for the carpet when we're hoovering. This window and glass cleaner, which is by Star Drops, and Mrs. Hinge recommends quite a few of the Star Drops products. Leather wipes for the sofa again. Washing machine cleaner. And we've got some more of that there. And I actually really, really like this stuff. Picked it up in Alistair. It's kitchen degreaser and I just use it on the work surfaces all the time. Um, and I also use Zaflora, which everybody seems to rave about. So I use that. That would make 4.8 litres. So I've got a little spray bottle, which needs filling up. But yes, yeah, Zaflora and water in there. Use it for the surfaces and you can spray it on anything and it's a really, really nice smell, but you can get all different scents. Um, and they sell it at most places, B&M, Home Bargains, places like that. And I'm sure all the supermarkets do them. And then I've got one of these, which is for doing the inside of the windows. We've got a window cleaner that does outside, but yeah, we'll do inside or like on the shower and stuff like that. We've got Stain Devils, which is just for getting out. 
devil stains. I've got some more Savlora, and that one is in bouquet, and it lasts forever. And that is everything out of my cleaning caddy. So I'm going to sort all of this out now and yeah, do some cleaning and see how I get on. Because I tell you what, Mrs. Hinge has totally inspired me to clean more often. Like I say, my house isn't dirty and what have you. But yeah. So if you've not checked out Mrs. Hinge on Instagram, go and check her out and watch her videos. And I'm sure you will get as hooked as I am and as hooked as a lot of the other Instagrammers are. So whilst I'm clearing away, I'd like to tag Jane Gammons, Helen at the Livingstones and Sarah SW to show me any of the hinge hole products and also what is in their cleaning caddy. So thank you for watching. Please give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video and I will see you in my next one. Bye.